Welcome back. Michelle Obama is helping inspiring chefs and Judas and the Black Messiah didn't always have that name and a critically acclaimed movie will hit theaters. Danny Backus has your eye on entertainment. Be great chefs. Michelle Obama is launching a kids cooking show on Netflix. This mochi and waffles is your new home. The former first lady is helping puppets Waffles and Mochi on their international journey to becoming chefs. Waffles and Mochi premieres on Netflix March 16th. Judas and the Black Messiah, a movie about the portrayal and assassination of Fred Hampton, chairman of the Black Panther Party, didn't always have that title. Director Shaka King says he titled the film Jesus Was My Homeboy, but there was pushback. You know, the Panthers did not deem themselves, you know, a, a Christian organization. So they were like, you know, we're not comfortable with that portrayal. Um, and so we, we backed away from it. Golden Globe nominated Judas and the Black Messiah hits theaters today. On tonight's new episode of MacGyver, Mac and the team rush to help when Maddie's former mentor and his embassy staff come down with a deadly, mysterious illness. Catch MacGyver this evening on CBS. And a far-reaching conspiracy, plus one man's fight for freedom are uncovered in the Mauritanian. My client, he's not a suspect. He's a witness. The movie starring Jodie Foster, Shailene Woodley, and Benedict Cumberbatch is based on the true story of Muhammad Ul Salahi, who was detained by the U.S. government for years without charge at Guantanamo Bay. The Mauritanian is in theaters today. That's your Eye on Entertainment. Danya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles. Honestly, I haven't heard of any of that except for Michelle Obama's cooking show. Yeah, me, me too. I know. Is that bad? No. No, I don't think no. so either. Yeah. But it's Jodie Foster, so she would she would typically do good movies. Yeah, and Benedict. So maybe worth, um, worth a watch. Yeah, Cumberbatch, Cumberbatch, yeah. however you say his name. I don't, know. I don't yeah, know. You know. He was in the last <laughs> movie, too, and he generally does some pretty good stuff, too. So right. have yeah. to give it a check. That's right. That's right. Well, coming up here on today's show, scammers, they're using the season of love to get your personal information. We talk with the experts about romance scams. That's next, right here on North Dakota Today.